Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Miranda and I am Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan. I am here with a POB inspired plan with me. But before we start the plan with me, I just wanted to remind you of a few things and also to announce our winner of the POB giveaway from last week. So first and foremost, if you enjoyed the video or the POB concept, make sure you show me some appreciation by simply giving me the thumbs up need that thank you so much guys in advance and number two make sure that you comment below so that you're eligible to participate in the giveaway for this week and reminder the winner will be announced next week and last but not least i would love to have you a part of the bella squad and you can join us by simply hitting the red subscribe button below this video along with the gray notification bell, and that will inform you of any time I upload or update new content. I know that things look a little bit different, but um, as I started to record the first part of the video, I just didn't like it, so I decided to change it up. Now, on to the winner of the POB giveaway for last week. That winner is YouTube subscriber name Cheeky. So Cheeky, make sure you send me an email or DM me on Instagram. Both of those contact uh, informations will be located below this video. Okay, guys, we are going to jump into the spread and I hope you like it. Let's get to it. So there are multiple different things, POB friendly things that you can do to date your planner if you have an undated planner. Now these stickers, I do agree, are rather small, but they're the same size as the writing here. So I'm okay with it. Um, it definitely goes with the color scheme I have planned for the week. So one of the first sticker books that we talked about purchasing on POB was this Color Story 2. And I felt it was a good book because it had so many different um, spreads that you could do so I am going to use the first theme which is like the mermaid theme and we're going to use that to plan our week washi tape I have some oldies um, because I noticed that some of the foiling here is holographic so I wanted to bring out some holographic washi and then on the very bottom I'm going to use some mermaid washi so guys, as I was pulling out, and some of the stuff is older, um, this washi tape came from Michaels and in a mermaid set, but everything in the set was more of the blues and the greens versus just a, you know, like a silver. I'm going to break out an old tool that I have not used in like forever. And I just wanna see if I can use it because I wanna remember why I stopped using it, if that makes sense. So this is that, uh, it's an echo tool. It's got a teeny tiny little blade on it and a lot of people use it to cut their washi. So it did a good job. I don't know why I didn't like it. You know, sometimes you buy things and you need to revisit. So I'm revisiting that. That's one, of, I think it's a slice tool. So I'm revisiting using that. All right, and I will tell you that I know that I bought this washi tape on a budget because all the washi tape that I purchased from Michaels back in the day was 40, 50, even 60% off. Never paid full price for any washi tape. Oops, let's try this again. I didn't like that little cricket. Mm -mm. That's why I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Let me grab my X-Acto knife. I like this because when I go here to slice with this good old X-Acto knife and then I grab this good tweezer, comes right up. All right. And we have to come on this side and do the same thing. All right. Let 
All right, so that is the only thing I'm gonna put down as far as that thicker washi tape right there on the bottom. And I'm going to use a little of this holographic just to tie in the holographic pops. And I hope my newbie planner babes, this would be a video that you would watch because I feel like when I do POB, because I initially created it because I met some new planner babes that just started planning and they of course were on limited budgets and I'm, everyone deserves to plan no matter what their budget looks like. So I try to also give like tips, good old planning tips. So adding the holographic washi in just to tie everything up. Very good. I think I'm happy with how that looks. And I definitely am going towards more of the blues and the greens. That's why I selected this. And I also selected those. So I like to layer stickers, guys. So I am going to layer one of these stickers. Layering stickers just gives you just gives your planner, I think, another look. It gives it something a little extra. So normally you put down a textured sticker and then on top of that, you can layer this way, you can layer this way, but I think I'm gonna layer this way after I straighten it up. And I'm lining it right with the side of here, okay? I like how that looks we are going to incorporate some of the coral in there as well. So I'm going to put this on Saturday. Um, my main man Marley is on his way here for spring break. So definitely a wonderful life. We love that little guy. Let's see what we can also get. Here's a checklist. We can put the checklist over here. Let's say on Friday. Another tip that you'll see me do is I like to flip my pages upside down. And the reason why I do that is because I tend to line up my stickers better when the page is upside down. There was definitely, I wanted to put some of these um, little clear stickers here down, and this will totally tie in all of the colors that we wanna use. And then I'm gonna find a quote that we can put down at the end of this page there. And we're gonna put something, we're gonna put this on the same, on the other side. So, what quote can we put there? We've already used this wonderful life. We can totally tie this in, seize the day. And let's see, I don't wanna layer because we just layered there. And I don't want to cover up. I'm gonna put the quote down I'm gonna bring this up and I'm gonna put the quote down. All right. We're gonna put seize the day. And I'm lining up, there's a line on here and I'm lining it up with the line. That helps me at least get my stickers just a little bit straighter. All right. Here we go, seize the day. And then we're gonna take this, I'm actually going to cut this sticker. So something that we planner babes love doing is taking a sticker and cutting it. Not only does that make it go further, you can use it in more than one place, 
but it gives your planner something extra. It actually makes it look like it's popping right off the page. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take half of it here and I'm gonna put it right on the edge. And I, I don't like the fact that this line here is sticking out. So I'm gonna grab a little bit of white out because I can see the line. And if it doesn't bother you, that's fine, but I'm just one of those kind of people that it bothers. So I'm gonna white out that line so that we can't see it through the sticker because this is a clear sticker. So let me tell you guys about sales going on this week. So we have a couple of sales going on. One of the sales, let's talk about Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby has all of their stickers, including Happy Planner stickers are 40% off, which means that you can get a sticker book for $11.99. That is a great price for a sticker book. Um, so definitely want to check out Hobby Lobby if you are needing sticker books. Let's see. Hobby Lobby. And all planners and planner kits, including the Happy Planner, are also 40% off. So for instance, if you wanted the opportunity to get, let's say, Happy Notes. Happy Notes are $7.99 this week. So that would be a POB-friendly purchase that you can make. All right. I would like to bring this sticker over here on Sunday and just says today and then I'm going to start kind of popping some of these other colors like this get to work I'm gonna cut this sticker flat on this side so I can stick it on the edge of my page here so we make sure that we bring the coral over here we need to bring more coral on this page and because I've used some of these stickers, sometimes uh, that makes it a little hard <laughs> to bring things. Okay, let's see. Pop of pink, we need another pop of pink somewhere. I like this, I'm walking on sunshine, but I feel like we have enough stickers down and we just really need to put in pops of coral places like this um, this shell and I am going to grab our colorful boxes or if you have purchased colorful boxes I know I've mentioned that it's a great sticker book to have they're actually coral stickers in the colorful boxes sticker book so I'm going to take this and place this on Wednesday up top. And I'm going to take this little, I'm probably gonna cut this in half, guys. I'm probably cutting it in half. I'm definitely cutting it in half. Because I feel like it's just too big to go there. It's kind of overwhelming. And we don't wanna overwhelm our spread. We wanna really have a cute, cohesive spread. We could put one side there and I'll tell you something else I want to grab I want to grab a um, coral color checklist and I want to put it down here on the bottom and the reason why is because we don't have on this side we really don't have anything on the bottom and we want our spread to be balanced and in order to have a balanced spread sometimes you gotta do on the right what you do on the left and of course these are not tweezers as you guys can see but I'm using them as as if they were tweezers okay the only thing I don't like is this notes up here and I feel like maybe we can put a piece of blue or how about this busy 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 sticker will that cover up notes 
because you could put you a nice little list there where it says busy, busy, busy. Okay. And it's just that simple to have stickers that are POB friendly and a spread that is POB friendly. So let's go over where the sales are this week. And by this week, I mean April 15th through April 21st. So once again, um, at Hobby Lobby, all stickers are 40% off and all planners and planner kits are 40% off. So that's definitely POB friendly. Um, Happy Planner at Joann's are 25% off. And as far as coupons from Joann's this week, there was just one that I saw, 40% um, off one item, or you can get five off of 35, 10 off of 50, or 15 off of 75. And then in your missions reward portion of your app, there are um, there is a five dollar reward and it's five off of five so can you imagine if you find a clearance item for five dollars or if it's a sticker book that you like that is um 25 percent off so they're like 14.99 and use that five dollars off that's about ten dollars for a sticker book so that's that's a really really good pop one and i didn't see anything at michael's but they do have um 40% off of all washi tape and stickers by um, the Recollections brand, which is their in-store brand. So um, a couple of options there for us that are shopping on a budget. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the POB video and you'll continue watching the series. And once again, a big congratulations to subscriber Cheeky. Make sure that you go and send me your information. And today is a Thursday that this video is going to be posted. So I need to get a response within three days or I will pick a backup winner so that we can keep this thing going. Okay, guys. Well, three things. Like the video. Comment. I'm down with P.O.B. Yeah, you know me. Comment below. And last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next POB video. And I'm looking forward to POB tips and POB spreads. Have an amazing day. Ciao, Bella.